Ladies and gentlemen, boils and gorls, welcome back. We opened a Dominaria pack. Uh, this is a chaos draft, which means everyone in the everyone in the draft has a different pack to open, so it's uh, different for everybody. What's up, Sammy? And uh, Mike B is going to be joining us shortly. This pack is actually very, very good. Uh, Clatter Sphinx is a very solid flyer. Journey Mage is a solid mana war. Sapperling my mutation and Shivan Fire are both very good. Tetsuko is a pretty sweet card to build around. Uh, I think we're going to take the Shalai because it's just a 3-4 flyer for 4. It's, it's a better rate than the Cloud Rear Sphinx as a flyer. And it has two very relevant abilities. So I'm going to just take Shalai here. Try to build around a Shalai in the Chaos Draft when we have no idea what our other packs or cards are going to be. I'm going to hold out through the fallout Knowledge pool, a foil knowledge pool, no less. Wow. Wow. Hold on one second, guys. Responding to Andrew. Trying to get some food tonight. Sammy, I did get your email. Sammy, whenever you send an email, I get it. That's just how email works. I get it. Uh, five mana? Crying out loud. Rotwolf is good. I like Rotwolf. Plus, it gives us a little infect. Did you get my email? My name is Sammy. I'm an email sending man. Oh, we could have Ogre Savant and Academy Journey Mage. We could have like double five mana. Wow, someone's going to get lucky. Shrieking Grotesque is pretty sweet. Uh, so is... I also got the computer. Oh, nice. Sammy, uh, the computer you sent me, it should work fine for Magic Online. I, I, Magic Online is not super intensive. You just need... Uh, mostly you want a bunch of memory. For some reason, Magic Online is kind of a memory hog. Gore Clan Savage or Shrieking Grotesque? This is a great card on color. This is a great card. I mean, of course we're leaning towards green because of Shalai's secondary ability. If you can activate Shalai in limited, it seems very, very good. We could also just take Morning Thrill. It doesn't seem great, though. Um, you also just don't need... I think we're just taking this because you don't even need the black. It's just a 2-1 flyer for 3, which is fine. But if you can make them discard... Creatures with no abilities get plus 2, plus 2. That's very... Pokemon Red Advanced, but I couldn't play any Pokemon... Mar what, is, what are Pokemon Randomizers? I don't even know what that is. Judge Unworthy is great. Uh, choose an attacker, scry three, real top card of your library. Judge Unworthy is damage equal to the card's current mana cost. So it's basically like a typical, um, like your typical deal three, deal four. Ideally, if you can find a thing. I mean, you're also getting to scry. Kavu Primark, also good. It's a three, three, four, four. Uh, you can convoke it, so it's easier to cast. And you can also kick it, which puts four counters on it, making it a seven, seven for eight. Um, so really versatile creature. This is another reason why, again, I love I love Kicker because it lets Thank you, it lets your cards be more useful at the top of the curve or the bottom of the curve, wherever you may need them. I'm gonna take the removal spell though. T Jesse, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. Really appreciate you, man. Uh, it's an additional cost, sacrifice permanent, exile an artifact, creature, or enchantment. That actually could be good. Just being able to get rid of anything. Intrepid Provisioner is is fine. Another human gets plus two, plus two. Like, I don't know how many humans we're going to have. This is a 2-5. I think we just take the Angelic Purge. It's just a fine card.
Celestia Clue Stone. I like a battering Crisis. Uh, whatever. Snare Swat attacks. You can pay the type of creature and put controls. This guy seems very good. I thought of you last night and got the fiance to go down to the Burger King for some Impossible Whoppers. Neither of us have eaten fast food in probably five years, but there's a Burger King literally two blocks from my house. And they were actually really solid. However, when we ordered them, the workers were like, do you like those? I don't like them. But maybe you will, which is just top drawer marketing, I'd say. Wow, that is good. I don't like this, but maybe you will. Uh, okay, I'm going to get it. And thanks. Hosta Snare Squad seems fantastic. I'm worried about these three drops, but even the other card, the Chrysis, would still be a three drop, so... Another three drop. Another three drop. A two drop. But I think our odds of actually having colorless mana is low. But maybe. Stalking drone, if you could have the colorless, is very, very good. It's just a three, four. First strike, don't care. Netcaster spider is good. I'm going to take the drone because I want a two drop. And I can still cast it even if, without, even if we don't have the... Uh... Yeah, I actually went to I went to go get an Impossible Opera again last night for dinner after I stopped streaming. And I get to the Burger King. And there's two drive throughs There's the left one and the right one. And I go to the left one because there's no one in there. And they're like, yeah, can you uh, just hold for one second, please? And I was like, yeah, sure, I can hold. So I hold. 2-2 two, two Flying Vigilance or a Thraben Sentry. Thraben Sentry seems great. We also have a way to sacrifice something in Angelic Purge. So I keep holding. 10 minutes go by, no one says anything. Someone pulls up to the right drive through They say something, something gets said back to them, and then they leave. The next person scoots up. And they're like, hey, welcome to Burger King, can I take your order? And I'm like, this guy literally just pulled up. I've been waiting for 10 minutes, and no one has said a word in this line. What? And so I just literally, I just left. I was like, forget it, this is, this is dumb. So I just drove off. I like waited in line for 10 minutes. And then the guy who just pulls up in the right drive through lane gets served. And I was just like, all right, weird feeling. Wow, I like that this Tangle Mantis came back. I also don't know why this doesn't have Reach. This seems like a perfect Reach creature. A Reacher. Reacher, if you will. Uh, I don't foresee this guy getting played, but it's a color. It's a non-color gentleman. two drive throughs and there was like one person I'm like if you guys can't handle if you guys can't handle like serving food after 10pm maybe you guys shouldn't just be should just close at 9 like normal how many things does this hit like literal nothing no 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 not one of our creatures gets buffed by muraganda petroglyphs it's so weird Brett I was just like why? Why would you just not address the person who's been waiting this whole time? They have to have a, I, they have to have a method to see that I'm in line, right? I don't know. It felt really weird. I was like, I, I felt offended, but I like it wasn't obviously it wasn't personal. I was like, there's no way you did this on purpose, but it's just like, it felt real shitty to like watch the person next to us just get their order, and I was like, but I've been here. I've been here this whole time. Uh, I don't want another three drop. It's funny that we opened two standard sets, Dominaria and Guilds of Ravnica. Me and my wife want to visit the U.S. and she really wants to see Florida for whatever reason. So we're visiting Orlando, Miami, Tampa, and maybe one more town. If you don't have a car, what's the best way to get around? Florida, not really great. It's not it's not great for public transportation, to be honest with you. There's no light rail system. Because Florida's a big state. If you don't have a car, I don't even know. Like if you're going between if you're going between those places, you can't you're not going between those places. Obviously without a car, right? Like so if you're in Tampa and you're trying to get around, I would probably you'd probably have to just lift everywhere, Lyft or Uber. I might just want this godless shrine to to let us cast the grotesque and maybe the, the guild gate comes back too oh loxodon smiter seems fantastic wow talk about three drops there's a lot of cards that i wouldn't mind coming back to two seven drops five five with reach and trample or a six seven
Centaur Healer. This guy's also good. Just a 2-2 two, two for 2. I mean, we're taking this guy, but... You know, Hooting Mandrels? Mardu Horde Chief is great. Dragon Scale Boon, also not terrible. Also, this is a 3-drop. I'm probably just going to take Hooting Mandrels. I mean, I really just don't want to... My 3-drop spot to be this compact... This... Not compact is the word I'm looking for? I don't know. So we have this funny story at BK. We used to go to the one on Main Street in Dunedin. We pull up and ask for some ICs. Pull up, tried to pay, but the guy working there just said, free better, and handed them to us. Some some few weeks later in the evening, we pulled in after F&M and ordered an IC and a cheeseburger. Same guy handed us a bag full of Whoppers and two ICs. Same thing. Free better and gave them to us. What the hell? I feel like I'd won some kind of secret Burger King lottery. Like I was on a TV show and they were recording me. I'd be like... Because did the guy know it was you and he's like, oh shit, this is the free guy that I give stuff to and he just gives it to you again? I can't imagine you just hit the lottery twice. Just hit the Burger King lottery. That's so weird. Apparently Burger King is a real weird place, guys. Past 12 is in past midnight? What time are they open till? Oh, dang. Got that late night Burger King. I'll just take Galvanic Bombardment. None of these cards are great. I'll take the playable card. Here's a bag of Whoppers. <laughs> Jesus. I mean, to be real, they're probably just going to throw them out. I don't know many Burger Kings that are open 24-7. Oh, interesting! They're, wow, I can get a, I can get a I can get an impossible whopper at any time of the day. That's insane. That's too much freedom, man. Uh, prevent all combat damage. Non-soldier creatures would deal this turn. Okay, whatever. You're terrible. Creature spells you cast. Like red mana costs six or less. Cost two. Six or more costs two. Less. So this guy would cost six. Oh wow, or four rather. <sighs> it's still a two-two. For the next six minutes, let's start a creature this turn. I mean, this is four mana. Why can't I choose both for, for four mana? Plus one, plus two, at, and storm. If this gave flying, it'd be great. None of these are any good. This whole pack is hot shit. <laughs> this pack is trash. Oh, you got Ver Varnadi shield, mate. Oh, uh, you also have Mulder Hulk. I don't think I, I think I'd rather just have a two drop than the big fat idiot. Amplify, I have to reveal birds or soldiers. You're a soldier. Do I have any? You're a soldier. You're a soldier. Wow, I actually have a quite, a, quite a few soldiers. So this guy's got to be a soldier, right? Oh, wow. That's not terrible. If I have, like, two soldiers in hand. Gain six life, draw a card. Okay. The guild gate did not come back, but the blade brand did. We have bars that are open twenty four seven, but you're not getting all flame grown impossible. Yeah, that's true. There's a there's a ton of things that are open twenty four hours, but just not like only some fast food restaurants are. Ugh. Populate. How are we doing on tokens? Not great, right? Yeah, okay. I'll just take the 6 7. It's on color. I imagine Europe isn't as quick adapting it because they are American companies, both Impossible and Beyond, the two major plant based companies. We have a bunch of 24 hour subways. Is that normal? I mean. Maybe. I literally don't know. Uh, 
I will say, as someone who is historically a predominant YouTube viewer who only recently started watching the stream, your viewership is much lower than I expected. You're currently underrated for some. I it's unknown to me as well, dude. I don't get it either. But I like I'm grateful for the audience I do have. I'm really really grateful for the uh, the the viewers and the supporters that I do have. I'm really grateful. They're all super super really enthusiastically supportive, and I love it. But I I thought the same thing, dude. I I don't understand it either. And I say that without any arrogance. I just know, like, I know my my magic pedigree. And I just never... I don't know. I, I don't know. That reminds me of Subway Server stories where they discuss the gross disorders. Guy wanted a full bottle of mayonnaise on a sub. I would vomit. That's That's terrible. Goblin Psychopath. Uh, I bought a bunch of new parts, so I just figured if people donate between now and like the end of the month, that that's what I'll that's what I'll put it towards. Um, yeah, I just have enough to get my computer in a couple years. Not even that many. It's like been three years, two or three years, and um, so I got a new processor, uh, a new motherboard, and ideally some new memory. When it's in stock again, it has been currently out of stock for a few days. Okay, last pack is... What is it, Judgment? Judgmento. Okay, so... Michael B. has returned. RAM is not as expensive in general. Uh, the RAM I'm looking at was pretty expensive, though. Unfortunately, as long as seven more cards in graveyard gets plus one plus one and has first strike. So this is a two two flyer becomes a three three flyer. Whenever a bird is put into Mike B's graveyard from the battlefield, put a feather counter on this, and then birdie boys get plus one plus one for each counter. That seems like a lot of bird work. Don't you crawl up through the fallout? Uh, put one counter creature. This is probably where we want to be. This is also a soldier, actually. Oh, thanks. Thanks, bro. I got a little... The B stands for beverage. Maybe Iron Shell Beta comes back. I do like that soldier synergy, though. Iron Shell Beta. Is that like Cat Scratch Fever? Yeah. I guess Snake... This guy's good. This guy's fine. Oh, Sensor Splicer, though. Oh, I like a sensor soldier, uh, sensor splicer. Oh my god, this is a soldier. That's amazing. How deep are we going on this one amplify bird? What does amplify do? Uh, you reveal birds or soldiers from your hand to get plus one plus one. You reveal creatures of the play? same type, and then it, you know, it gets gets uh, gets plus one plus one counters. Okay. Cat scratch fever. Doesn't feather get feather counters too? What are you saying right now? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he regularly peels back the fabric of space time. I, I, I got suckered into the, into the soldier hype. What is this? Kinship would be elf or shaman, right? I don't think I have any elves or elves or shamans. I bet you got one elf. Do you, you really? You think so? Yeah, right there. Where? You missed it. This? No, man. Keep going. No, you missed it again. Okay. <laughs> I feel like you're bullshitting me right now. Yeah, it might be. That's fu that's messed up, man. You're messed up. You're messed up. Coordinated barrage actually seems decent with our with our soldier deck, right? Our little soldier deck. <coughs> I love my little soldiers. Okay. And their decky decks. This makes an elf, but you can't ever reveal it to Wolf Skull Shaman. So shut up, Michael. Shut up. God. I think Barrage is good, especially because we have all these these soldier synergies. Soldiers, if you will. Oh, I like Farseek. It lets us get a swamp. Hey, back it up. You back it up. Got him. God, he's so needy. I like this Morai, but... He just wants donut. Don't we all? I'm just a squirrel looking for a donut. Hmm. See what I did there? No. That was good, right? 
I don't understand. Okay, well. Uh, oh, dragon. When it dies, destroy a non-creature permanent. Oh, that's beautiful. Let's take it. Too bad it's not a dragon soldier, though, right? Am I right? Am I right? I guess so. Michael, listen. Listen, Michael. Michael, cat scratch fever, okay? By the way, what's going on, Mike B? Not much eating my donut. <laughs> eating my donut. <clears throat> Any good kind of donuts today? What do you got there? What's that one? Orange cream sugar. I'm sorry, what? Orange cream sugar. Okay, you don't have to yell. Apparently I do. We're all right here, Michael. Oh, what about this trap jaw kelpie? That's not a beast soldier. Was it made with love? Uh, probably not. It's from Wawa, so it's probably made with hate. Why do you think Wawa makes things with hate? Because <clears throat> if you work at Wawa, you gotta hate. You gotta hate. Why? Man, who really wants to work in a gas station? Come on. Well, it's what? nobody's dream job. I mean, it's a nice gas station. I mean, yeah, but it's still a gas station. It's a nice gas station. Okay, I heard you the first time. Did you? I'll take two drop. <clears throat> Actually, we'll take naturalize. We don't have a naturalize effect. What flavors you get in here, man? Uh, it's cherry and watermelon mostly. There's a little bit of coke in it. Whoa, don't tell people that on a stream, man. Not that kind of coke. What's a dream job? I don't know, like... Butt sniffer? Your dream job is butt sniffer? No, I'm just saying in general, that's everyone's dream job. I don't think so, man. Also, you can't anyone do that, don't you? I mean, you can just do that. You don't have to have like a yeah, but you got to get paid for it. That's the difference. If it, if you're in it for the love of the butt sniffing, then you just do it. No, oh, that's no oh, man. You got to get paid. If you do something well, you know, then what? You better get paid for it. Well, do it well, and you probably will. Mine is to get paid for sleeping. Um. I mean, you can set up for sleep studies. That's a thing. I don't know where they're at, but... God, if Mike got paid for sleeping? Jesus Christ. I'd be buying all our meals, boy. <laughs> we, would, we would live in a, a much nicer house. We'd live in a mansion. <laughs> <laughs> oh, crying out loud. <sighs> then you'd be like, you better go to sleep, man. That would be the one time Mike doesn't go to sleep because he would consider it work. <laughs> and then he would just... That's the trick of getting Mike to sleep less. I want six figures, not those sleep study pennies. Well, unfortunately, the world you're thinking of may not exist. Yeah, I don't know if there's a six-trigger job for sleeping. Because if there was, boy, I'd have it. Would you? I just played with cards and dice all day and made great money. Just wish it was magic, lol. You what do a little gambling? What is this thing? Look at that art. A little casino action. What do you do a little gambling? A little casino action? I don't think we have any beasts in here. We might have like one sneaky beast. Oh, you're a dealer. Okay. But this guy still might just be better. He regenerates himself. Probably better than Force Mage Advocate. But a one encounter on a creature that seems really good, even if you have to return a card from their graveyard.
Is there really any dream jobs left in this world? Yeah, definitely. There's definitely some, right? There's got to be some. I believe. You wouldn't consider what you're doing right now a dream job? I think a lot of people would. Another human gets plus three, plus three. Do I have any, how many humans? How many humanos do I have? That's a human. That's a centaur shaman. Do centaurs have two rib cages? Why would you ask me that? <clears throat> oh, wait. Now I know. I see what you're saying. Because you'd have one. Hold on. The horse part and the man part. I get what you're saying. God, it's so hard because then I have to like sneak out. You'd have one here, but then down the bottom you'd have one down here where your horse part is. <clears throat> I don't know their anatomy. <laughs> well, maybe you should. Centaurs are spiders. They have six limbs. I hate to break it to you, but spiders have eight legs. Did you think spiders had six legs? Oh, this is awkward. I guess stalking, stalking, stalking drone isn't that great here because it. Uh, you doing alright, man? Those are tissues, man, not napkins. Well, when in need. When in need. Go ahead. Feel the creed. Feel the creed. <clears throat> well, they did create their own prison, I guess. <laughs> My own prison. Was, I don't know if that's the lyrics, but... That was terrible. It's probably correct. It's not. <laughs> I, I'm tempted to add one swamp just for the, the shrieking grotesque, but I'm also tempted to not care about it. My dream bob would be working for myself. Doesn't really matter what. Yeah, Your dream bob? Dream bob. <clears throat> you might be running a marijuana dispensary. That's a thing you can do. Maybe you can. I was thinking of the type of spider that have devolved front legs. What? Is that a thing? <clears throat> Is that a thing? The rib cage just goes all the way down one long rib cage, more like a rib tube. <laughs> Not to be confused with the latest Burger King offering, Burger King offering the rib tube. Oh. You know the rib tube, that right? That sounds gross, man. You sound gross, man. In fact, I bet your last name is actually Grossman. Michael Grossman. That's Michael B. Grossman to you. Oh, God, there's all me's. I should just move these over, I guess. I feel like I'm constantly moving them. Don't worry about it. Don't tell me what to worry about. I'll worry about whatever I want to. Fine. <clears throat> you don't know me. Oh, now I'm dead. Big fan alert. Some spiders have adapted their two front legs for purposes other than walking. And in these cases, the front legs may be diminished in size to be inconspicuous. What? What? The, like the uh, the wandering spider? The one that runs at you? And is super poisonous? The wandering spider? Yeah. I feel like you're just making things up right now. Definitely not. Is it? Does it bother you to be drunk like 90% of the day? No. Alright. Aren't all spiders walking spiders, Michael? They don't float, stupid. No, like they, they, they like... They hold up their front two legs like this. And they walk on their back two legs. No one's done. No one does that. It's too They're going to get you. No one's going to be got. No one's going to get. No one's going to get getted. Michael hitches rides on bananas all the time. It's unbelievable. Hex proof. Oh, good. They didn't get anything. Oh, look at one drop. Oh, nice. Look at this war chief. How can, a, how can a beast be a war chief? Mike is always high on the milk of the puppy. <laughs> come at me, bro. He did. He did come at me. What makes the Michael be red? Melatonin. 
Do you know what melatonin is? Yeah. It's stuff on your skin that makes your pigments. You're thinking of melanin. Maybe. Melatonin is what helps you sleep, Michael. I must have that naturally then. <laughs> Jesus boy, do you. <clears throat> I need another drink to go with my drink. What does that mean? <laughs> Mike puts the... <laughs> yeah, I guess it makes sense if his body is full of melatonin instead of melanin. Oh, we just get to go hooting mandrels into Axbane stag? Oof. Big hoots. Give a hoot, Mike. Don't pollute. Is that your mom? Mm hmm. Oh, I was just kidding. I ain't gonna lie, Craig. What did she want? She's just saying hi. Was she? Yeah. She never just says hi. She always has an ulterior motive. She said hi and something else, and you know. She need to take you to the liquor store? She probably wants Mike to take her to the liquor store. Michael, can you take me to the liquor store, please? At the beginning of your upkeep, discard a card if you don't control an ogre. Well, that's going to escalate quickly. What made the red man red? You know, if these two guys were beasts, that'd be, be a lot cooler if you did. If they were, you know what I'm saying. You get it. Um, okay, we attack, they just do the thing. Hmm. Yeah, but that one's a soldier. Yeah, I guess that's true. I guess that's true. I'm just going to attack here. If they want to block, that's fine. Like, then we get to three even century flip. Which is just another Hunter, five four replacing it. Catman stole the bed. Catman? Yeah, Catman. Catman do? Yeah, Catman do. Catman C is Catman do? Oh wow, they're gonna take a oh alright. Well I'm probably just killing this. Oh dang it. Oh Billy. Did you get a little, little little stuff? A little drink? A little thing? Thing in the ice? A little thing in the ice, Michael? Yeah. Now it's a human soldier is still it's still a soldier, okay. <clears throat> Michael is just mono noises. The whole time just mono noises. You make noises too, you little Mitch. What are the noises I make? That wouldn't be appropriate to share them. Good lord, what does that mean? Dead Reckoning. Put target creature card from your ground on top of your library if you do Dead Reckoning. You'll stand with your power to target. I see. I see. I see. I'm drinking and I see. Oh. Hmm. Okay. I see. I see even more. Well. Isn't that special? Wait, did that put the card on top? <clears throat> yeah, I don't think he took any damage. Right? Oh wait, hold on. They put it on top of their library, and then they just surveilled it back into the thing. Okay, well. I feel like we have a good amount of flyers, and I don't know where they are. 
They're in the dead of night. The flyers are in the dead of night. That's what you said? Mm-hmm. Okay. Just making sure. Return a land to its owner's hand. You bounced your own land, replayed it, and now you're going to... Fog of Gnats. <laughs> e okay. Gross. You're gross. Not as gross as that. You're grosser than that. How dare you. Got him. Have you ever seen a Fog of Gnats? Shrieking grotesque without the discard. I've never seen a Fog of Gnats. <clears throat> Boy, you don't want to. Don't I? Man, this uh, this mask of Avacyn is a real it's a real buzzkill. The G is not silent. S fog fog of Gnats. <clears throat> Gnats. It's from the Italian. Gonazzi. This sounded like something else. Hmm. Gorlami? Does it sound like Gorlami? I said Gonazzi. I know what I said. Okay. Let's block here. I'm going to snap this dude's neck clean off unless I got a counterspell. Not equipping this Max of Mask of Avacyn is interesting. Well, you got a twitch chip, 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 chip. <coughs> clip. A twitch chip, 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 clip. Mm -hmm. That's what you just said. Okay, well. I don't have any other humans. Well. Infect is pretty bad here because I don't want to really them infect damage. They're just going to block and this guy doesn't have trample. Ugh. We're killing Gnazis. I'm in the Nazi killing business. The Gnazi. Well, this guy just kills us in two turns. <clears throat> right? Right. But if they don't have any other creatures, then you go in the race. No, they only take three. What, what race am I winning? If on the next turn you can get the six seven through and the other guy through, and then do that how am again. I gonna get this through? They have a blocker. They've always had a blocker. Oh, they can return that guy to you. Oh yeah. And by return you mean regenerate? I thought it was return. Re what do you return? Yeah, I thought you returned it to your hand. No, you just regenerate it. <clears throat> yeah, then we're probably dead. Well, at least he gave me false hope. That's the important part. Look at all these sweet synergies. No human synergy, no beast synergy. Nothing to delve. I'm just holding this guy because it doesn't do anything on this board. And also, if we draw the bird, uh, I'd rather have a 3-3 bird than a 2-2 bird. How do you guys still call them? Talking about the Ganazis? Yep. And the two turn clock is in effect. We have a lot of flyers in our deck. One, two, three, four, one, two. Shalai would just literally have to jump block, which would be sad. Unfortunately, hexproof is also a thing. We did see Spire Golem and Mask. Oh, geez. Okay. Well. End game. Okay. My wrist really hurts from my keyboard. Um, I don't know what I would suggest for that, actually. 
You can get a rest for your arm. Or why don't you, your, why don't you give wrist. it a rest? Do you ever think about that? <clears throat> like a keyboard rest? Oh, they keyboard make rest. Wow. Wow. You could get a keyboard rest for your arm. I'm going to be a keyboard rested man. We could have drawn any of these flyers here. Could have drawn Angelic Purge. Could have drawn Coordinated bar Barrage or Judge Unworthy as well. Oh. These, these were our seven outs here. We hit none of them. Did you say lol? Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. What are you lolling at? The anime titty comment. Where? <laughs> okay, that's pretty good. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, boy. Super Fritz, what's going on, buddy? I don't feel like our deck is very good after... After that one, after that round. Okay, here we go. Godless Shrine off the top. Godless Shrine, huh? I just want to get my value, my discard value. Any counter this? Don't do it, man. Rabbits can definitely make noise. I'm a rabbit, Greg. Can I make noise? Yes. Is that what cool? Let's go. I told Andrew we can go to the Craft Street Kitchen at like 9. What was the response? He said okay. All right. Is that okay with you? Man, they got those sweet deals. Yeah, I'm okay with it. Is it an eyelash? Is that your eyelash, man? Probably. Messed I up. was splinkle a couple in for you. I know you like them. <laughs> I mean, it gives it a nice little flavor, apparently. Hero's downfall, that guy. On a 2 2? Wow, that is, that is hateful. <clears throat> swamp? We don't have, there's no swamps in the deck, okay? I thought you put one in. No, that would be stupid. Oh. Not if you drew it right now. I can't stand it. I know you planned it. Wow, you play. You bounced my land in my hand? That's rude, man. I like your little Beastie Boys song there. Just someone in the chat mentioned Beastie Boys. More like good. Beast Downfall, am I right? You actually are right, Jacob. <clears throat> are you gonna block? No? Didn't think so. Broski. Oh, that is a Jacob. I recognize his username. Yeah, it's Nano Joe. C. Speaking Spanish. That means yes in Spanish. Oh, thank you. I had no idea. You're welcome. Gracias. What's that mean? It means thank you. Oh. Man, I'm learning so much. Mm -hmm. I'll be a regular Spanish speaker before the day is over. See. Si. Wait, I thought yes was yes so. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, so that it gets all separated, man. Icies are the worst because you'll be sucking from the from the bottom the way the way Mike sucks the juices out of the trash bag, and uh, like the top will get all dry and like the ice is just completely dry at the top. Got got to suck all them juices out. <laughs> oh, good times. What is this thing? A two-two flyer and a two-one graveyard boy. Otherwise known as a gravy boy.
Then my mic sucks the juice out of the trash bag. I'm dying here. Yeah, this is fine. Has anyone tried the new purple mattress from Facebook? No. Well, it's not from Facebook. Yeah, I thought purple was just the name of the company. Yeah, right? they're just advertising on Facebook. You got a purple mattress, man? No. Hmm. I have a. I, I got my mattress on Amazon. You get one of those fancy space beds? I don't know if it's a space bed. No, it's from Facebook. Wow, okay, take it easy. All right, take it easy. Can't stand it. Yeah, now I'm playing it. Um. Hey, Mike, did you know there's a smoothie, Sunny D? Oh, that's with extra burn your throat. Sunny mm. D, it'll burn your throat. Smooth, Sunny D. Goes down easy. What is this? Fathom Seer. It's always a Fathom Seer. Mm. Or a Will Bender. Is it always those things? Little hairs and things. 5-3, huh? It's a 5-3, good buddy. Well, we're just alphaing here because everybody trades with this guy. And then this guy flips. Oh, I get to kill both of these guys? Oh, yeah, I was like, that seems bad. ba 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 bad Birder, birder, blah, 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 blah. <clears throat> Throat hurts. What is this? What is what is this? What are you showing me here? It's just a link to a purple. Okay. Final answer. Okay, we just won the game. Wow, that was a. That had four cards in our hand. Evidently, they weren't very good. You're not very good. <clears throat> wow. That's messed up, man. You're messed up. It just keeps walking right into these. Boy, Dave is Boochel. You know what? I'd like more lands, but I'll keep it on the on the draw. Smoochal. I like to smoochal. Don't talk about my boochal. <coughs> Shoo. Shut up. Oh, I could have got the Godless Shrine. Oh, God, I totally forgot the Farsi gets Godless Shrine. Wait, you actually have a Godless Shrine in your deck? Well, the first the first way you can tell you about it, Magic, is because you call it a main board, which is not an actual thing. That's a, that's a fictitious thing that was invented by... Uh, the bureaucrats in Hollywood. The big Hollywood big shots. This guy can't block. As long as you control a demon, it has regenerate. Okay, that's fine. Do -do 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 -do. And you shake it all The up. demon in me. The demon in me? Mm -hmm. What does that mean? Just a lyric. I don't know, man. Recent studies have shown that Frank studied recently. It's true. Can we talk about the demon in you again? No. Well, that's too bad. What's your favorite Cannibal Corpse song? Favorite Cannibal Corpse song? I don't have one. What's your second favorite? <laughs> uh, loud Noises. I'm a big fan of their 17 Turtles album. 17 Turtles? Yeah, that was one of their... I think that was one of their classics. I think that, come, that came right after uh, 
Tomb of the Mutilated, and there was 17 turtles. <laughs> oh, sh Tomb of the Mutilated. Good lord. That is a real title of one of their albums. Should I block this stupid villainous ogre? No. No. It is the children who are wrong. Zombie tidal wave? What is that? What is that? Is that a is that a cannibal corpse song? I think my biggest criticism of the Seventeen Turtles album is that it just didn't have enough turtles. <laughs> I was with them when there was only nine turtles. <laughs> yeah, they've come a long way from that. It's been, that was a while ago. It's been a while since the, the extra eight turtles were added. It's been a while since I have added eight turtles. How long has it been, would you say? Oh, God. What do you think I searched for for that one? Maybe? Yep. Okay. It's, it's good. It's good. I like when I can predict what my, my what someone searched for to... Come on, land. Come on, land. Oh, that's not land. It's the exact opposite of a land. Pretty much. It's been a while since my... The fall of album Next Sweaters is good. Yeah, that's one of their best ones. If you want to destroy my <clears throat> neck sweater, whoa, 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 pull my neck as I walk away. Pull my neck. Pull it. Watch me unravel. My neck is naked. 17 turtles across the way. <laughs> That's good. Someone please clip together sad moments from the 80s TMNT show with Nickelback songs. That's a really obscure... That's a really obscure request. Hey man, you want in your watch? Yeah. Oh, you actually are doing that? Yes. Oh. It is a it is a manual wind watch. What does that actually mean? It means if I don't wind it every two days or so, it will stop running. Huh, that's weird. Why? Because it's just crazy. I don't know how that technology works. <laughs> I don't understand you crazy watch technologies. You got the other ones that have to spin to work. Yeah, those are automatics. They are they are wound by your 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 movement. Oh, just gonna kill my shalai. And you got your little ogie boy back, little ogie. So why would you ever want a manual? Uh, you mean that you have to wind yourself? Yeah. I mean, you don't necessarily want it because it's a manual. You just it's just a. The it just way happens it, to be. Yeah. That's how it's gonna be. I'll still flip it. Sure. Flip it, kick it, punch it, bop it, spit it, tomb it. Spit it. Wow. Sing it. Turtles. Sing it, turtles. Sing it, turtles. Sing it loud. Sing it proud. Sing it, turtles. Today. Do they not? Oh, they did the same thing here where they put it on top and then they surveil. That's weird, man. This guy is a real McBeal. <laughs> oh, God. My watch has batteries because, you know, the future. <laughs> I, can, I feel that. Yeah, I feel the future, bro. Well, we're definitely getting in there. Let's do that first. I feel the future in me. You feel it in you? Yeah. Like, where exactly inside you? In my gut. Hmm. But not like you're not like the not like the bee hole or anything, right? No. Okay. It comes after the gut. Okay. You know the opening scene where the Africans sing the chant and Simba gets lifted in the air? It's just some African language that says it's a lion. Is that true? 
The day it, we it's a lion. It's it's a lion on the planet with the mic rolling high in Magabee's sky. Elephant, soldier, dragon. So we can actually. Oh my! Oh my! Oh! One, two, three, four. We'll play Thraben Boy. <laughs> As another soldier, which gives us two soldiers. So this choose a creature type according to the so target attack or blocking creature with number. So if they try to double block my smiter, we need to give Chris a Mike nickname. Like, what Mike is he? Bald Chris, Bald Mike, Bald Mike. That seems like it's too easy. All mics are too easy, though. It's not like it's That's a difficulty fair. thing, or they're like, you need a harder mic. Tall Mike? No, because there, there's other mics that are tall, though. Yeah, I'm taller than all the other mics. So. Yeah, but also, Andrew's pretty tall, and so is... Uh, Elk Tears? Uh, Elk Tears is tall, too, yeah. But not as tall, though. It's not a contest, okay? If it was, I won. Okay, take it easy. Andrew. Oh, you mean Mike. Wow. <laughs> oh my god, what is all these floaty boys? How tall is Mike B? Mike B is about 6'7". Is Kerwitz Seattle Mike? <laughs> I didn't know he was... I didn't, I didn't know he was Seattle Mike. I didn't know he was... I didn't, I didn't know he was... I didn't know he was. I didn't. I didn't know he was. Well, we know too many people in Seattle, so I don't think anyone can be Seattle Mike because then it's just like it's too many. I didn't know he was. I didn't. I didn't know he was. Like this. This is Raffo down. Well, he claimed it, so I guess he's Seattle Mike now. On the planet. We also have three soldiers now, so we can kill anything. 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 Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Wait, that means I can't move from Seattle? Why would you want to move from Seattle? You can't move anywhere. Does it say non creature permanent? Okay. Uh, I'm going to kill you first. Are you going to move to a country road? Okay, this one's green, so that's what I'm signing the order for there. Um, okay, who do I want to keep alive? Probably the dragon, right? Dragon, dragon, rock the dragon, dragon, ballsy. At or, some point, I'll be told kindly by Bezos to move. Wow. <laughs> They're like, uh, if you don't work for the Amazon Corporation, we're going to have to ask you to vacate the premises, Christopher. Well, we won the game. We won the match. So our deck is apparently not as bad as I thought it was. Not only do you have to move, you have to give him seven grand. It'll be by drone strike. <laughs> well, President Bezos at that point would probably be evacuating Seattle for his own personal, uh, you know, you know what I'm saying. What if Bezos ran for president and he was like, everyone gets two thousand dollars a month, literally everyone? Like, would he just get the not? Would he just he just get? Would he just get the nomination? He'd get my like, vote. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, like, that's crazy. Can he, is that a thing that's possible? Two thousand a month. Uh, I mean, probably it would cost a lot. It would cost two thousand a month for everybody. Yeah. So let's do. There's like what three hundred fifty million Americans. But then also like. Um, we all know that money's just going right back into Amazon, so it doesn't matter. Right, Andrew Yang is proposing universal basic income, but I, that's my point. Like, I'm saying Jeff Bezos gives an extra $1,000 more. That's that's only $70 billion. A year or a month? Yeah, a year. A oh, year? No, that's a, that's a month, actually, so maybe that's a little too much. Is it? <clears throat> he might have to cut back on his jets. Yeah, a bunch of people have pros using universal basic income. It doesn't have a lot of traction right now, though. Like, 
It's not talked about a it's lot. It's still either. a very new. It's still a very new idea. I mean, I, I'd like my rent to be free. That'd be cool. I mean, that's like someone being like, people have proposed flying cars, but it's never happened yet. Well, yeah, of course, because it's still new. I mean, you'd probably find a way to not go to to not collect the universal basic income, knowing you. It'd like be like some kind of task you have to do. To hey, man, that? you got to wake up by ten on Saturday to go get it, and then he'd be like, "I, I don't need it this month. I'm good." Look, bro, I'm a lot of things, but if it was a thousand dollars, yeah, I'd be up. Really? Because you don't get up for your job that pays you. So, sure, I do. <laughs> okay. Also, they finally they finally asked me to stop being late, so I'm probably gonna follow that rule. Oh, they asked you. Yeah. Wow. Wow. <laughs> they didn't technically demand it, but you know. Gee, it's almost like that's a requirement of your job. Uh. Okay. Okay. I'm just gonna attack here because what are they gonna do about it? Nothing. I didn't know I couldn't do that. Let's see, I did know I couldn't do that, though. <laughs> did you know where we're going? We don't need roads. I have you seen do. Back to the Future? Yes, I have. Okay, I've it's seen hard. the first one and the second one. I've not seen the third one. third one's the worst one. I, I liked it because it was a cool cowboy one, but, like, I acknowledge that it is the worst one for sure. I just never got around to watching it. It's still on my hard drive. Also, I basically watched it out of spite. <clears throat> what did you watch out of spite? Back to the Future? Yeah. You watched Back to the Future out of spite? Yeah. Because you kept making fun of me for about it, so I was like, fine, I'll watch Wait, it. that's when you watched it? Yeah. Oh, that's hilarious. I watched it by myself. I was like, I'm fine, I'm going to watch it. I would have watched it with you. Just block here, right? I didn't think this guy was getting pumped. I guess he did. Really? Okay. With the sun rolling high in the Michael B. sky. You know the Michael B. sky? Also, you guys kept referencing it, and I was like, I gotta know these references. Who? Who's you guys? Uh, you most of the time. Oh, that was like ages ago. Yeah, it was a while ago when I watched it. Like three years ago or something. What? Really? Yeah. I w you never told me any of this. I'm pretty sure I told you I watched them. You're a liar. <laughs> <laughs> Have we talked about the future of Magic Esports? Article? I haven't read the whole thing yet. I've only read some of it. What's that about? Your mama. It's about my mom. It's about your mama. The future of Magic Esports is about Michael Bartholomew's mom. It's a It's a good read. It's about your mama. Should I just return this glistener elf to their hand and put a counter on this guy? Yeah, sure, why not? I don't think that does anything. It's about Mike's mama. Dude, the article looks super long. I started to read it today, but I had an appointment, and I was like, nah, I'm good. I'll finish this later. It looked really long. And I was like, wow, this is like 17 bullet points you got here. Aren't they, like, taking away drafts or something like that? Taking away drafts? Yeah. <laughs> no more drafts. Wow, look at this thing. Jesus. This is a lot to process and digest. Ooh, look at that cryptic command, though. That thing is spicy looking. Yeah, but, you... but what? Nothing. What were you going to say? Nothing, man. I want to hear it. You, well, too bad. You don't get to. What? It was going to be stupid. What was it going to be? It was going to be stupid, okay? Well, let's hear it. <laughs> it's going to be like, they're not doing modern anymore either. Who's not doing modern anymore? Your mama. Save the modern for your mama. Isn't that, isn't that how the saying goes? Yeah, man. Probably. Yeah, man. Not drafting. Can someone link me? No, see, listen. This is Mike. This is Mike stoking the flames of fear here. Oh god, Briarhorn is so good. Mm, boy, I guess you're just gonna eat my Loxy boy. 
Oh, Oxy boy. The pipes, the pipes are calling. You know that song? No. You know the Loxy Boy song? No. Boy, aren't you a Loxy Boy? No. I feel like I'm all out of juice. I'm all out of juice. There's no juice inside me. No, there's juice inside me. I haven't gotten rid of that. I can't put any more juice inside me, though, because I'm all out of it. I knew you. What is this? At the beginning of your end step, if a permanent you control left the battlefield this turn, put a unity counter on it. Oh dear. What's a unity counter? And do? then it gets creature. Uh, it's just a, it's just the kind of counter it gets. Is it like a plus one plus one counter? Is it like a button 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 button? Is this live? No. Sorry. Definitely rerun. I mean, I don't think it's surprising that Artifact, a game by Valve, who is a, a notable software developer, had a better had a better client than Arena. But I mean, Arena is still a great client, and you know, it's. It, I think the important part is that Magic: The Gathering is a better game than than Artifact. What's Artifact anyway? I forgot. What was that game? More seeing? like Shardifact. <laughs> That's true. It is more like Shardifact. Because poop. Oh, I see. Because poop. Because shards. Okay, so this guy's just going to do, do the business. Believe in his love, am I allowed to love? My gumby is a turtle. He lives in the trash. He's a turtle every day. Let's put a counter. Choose target card in opponent's career. I'll give you Glistener Elf back. And I'll put a counter on this guy. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna see if using this guy is really where I want to be right now. What, are you worried about getting poisoned from a 1-1? Well, it's not just a 1-1. This gives him Exalted. Oh god, now you're gonna kill it? Oh god, why is this? Really? Silknet? Getting it on. Oh god, I just wanna vomit. What a 2 for 1. Shard of fact, do 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 do, Michael B. Do 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 do, Michael B. My name is Michael B. Do 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 do. This game is over. Do 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 do. Uh, that's. Oh, you're gonna tap my guy. I was like, that's a weird choice. I could just block it. <laughs> then they play there. They're Elf Boy. Elf Boy, sweet chariot. He just swiped away to Larry and a cat. What does that mean? I have no idea what that means. Wow, look at all these look at all these Mirrodin cards they're dropping on us. What are you talking about your sweet chariot for? I just like talking about my sweet chariot. Sweet chariot. Bob Mono, Michael B is every day. How's your ice, man? Pretty good. Naturalize. Okay. Naturalize. What about it? I don't know. Look with your naturalize. You got a counter spell for a silk net? No. You don't burn the tinder? I don't even know what that means. What is what is this language you're talking about, Gloomy Mort? Oh god. Uh, would you like to play first? God, would I ever would I ever like to play first? <sighs> yeah, let's keep it. Hooty hoot. It's called Big Hoots. It's also Hooty Hoot. Give a big hoots, Mike. Don't pollute. 
Michael B is watching you. Michael B's every move. Michael B. Five grand. Jeez. Where are you looking? Oh, for that? For that yeah. Mike Diodato original? Yeah. It's is it like a one of cover art? No, it's just like a buy it now. Like, it's too high, but I just watched it because it looks good. How big, look I don't good. know how big it is. What does that mean? Is it the size of a normal comic? Well, no, it's 11 by 1725. Oh, so it's just a drawing. Gotcha. Gotcha. I'm a, I'm, I'm a back of a gotcha. Back of a gotcha. Bah. Bah. What are you, some kind of sheep? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I think so, man. All right, now we can get that godless shrine. I thought you were lying about that. Lying about what? The Gala Shrine? Mm hmm. Are you, why? Wait, you thought that was just a meme that I did for the whole time? Mm hmm. <laughs> well, that's pretty funny. Well, isn't that special? Hooting mandrels. They are hooting. Man, Delve and, uh. And Threshold are two very, very, uh. Opposing abilities. You're right. Hey, you try to get seven cards in your graveyard? Take some of them out of there. Oh, I don't want to. Too bad. Do it anyway. Got him. Hooty hoot. I can be your hooty hoot man. How come the hooting man is a 4-4, four four, but the, the fish is a 5-5? Five five? What's up with that? I don't know what you're saying to me right now. I think you might be drunk. Oh yeah, no problem. Alex. Here's just, uh, it's 8-13, 2019. Scream it, Michael. Scream the date. It's like save the date, but you scream it instead. I did a, I did a, I did a oopsie there. I said the date before, so you, so you won't know. We'll think it's a rerun. Oh, it's really awkward. Oh, look at that veteran armor giving all your little little boys. Giving all your little boys a buff. <laughs> giving them giving them buff boys. Oh, little militant monk. That guy's aggressive. I got an ape and a human scout. Okay. Oh boy. So this is just a one one? Or this just deals one, rather? <laughs> Stag it up. Hooting Mandrels is basically Tiny Hogak. Basically the best card. Edible pine cone ice cream cones exist. What? Gross. How do you know? That sounds like it'd be delicious. A pine cone? If it's edible. Come on, Michael. You love edibles. We were just talking about you the other day. Michael's always eating edibles, dude. Wow. Skip your draw step. Tap it. Two untapped creatures to control. Draw a card. If they can draw two cards. Oh, no. All right. Let's get in there. I spent seven mana on an elk. What are you talking about? Are you drunk? What do you got over there? You got a little dog? Mm-hmm. How's he doing? He's doing pretty good. He's doing a pretty good dude. I moved his, uh, Actually, he dropped three so cards. No, he dropped two. Hair floof tuft. Hair floof tuft. Do, 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 Did you like inspecting that box? I always inspect the box. Thank you. Uh, pass. I'll pass. I got a thank you in the chat. 
Oh. Stay with Joe. Thanks so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. It was really quiet. Welcome back. I didn't hear it. Maybe you didn't. No, I did because I just told you about it. Maybe, but maybe you didn't. Why would I not? It. I don't know what you do. Doing those things. It's Mike B, and he's gonna be in trouble. Hey now, Mike B. It's Michael B. So here's an interesting situation. This is gonna deal two. It's gonna, we're gonna name human, so we can deal two damage to this guy, which put, makes it a two one. But then it's running one, so we're only dealing one to it. So this guy takes two, and this guy takes two. So it's actually probably just better to kill the Avacyn's Pilgrim here, because that would leave our guy alive. Right? We're dealing two damage. This basically becomes a 2-1. It prevents one damage, so it basically becomes a 2-2. Two, two, so we're dealing two to this and two to this. This guy dies. So we'll coordinate a barrage. This guy. Oh, they targeted the Avacyn's Pilgrim. Oh, that's even better. Oh, but that's insane. Just might be. Because now we get to kill both. Oh, for. wow. That's busted. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. You might be right. I may be crazy. Here's Mike's number. I want to put Mike's number in the chat one day, and then you guys can all text him. <laughs> he can wake up to like Here 40 text messages. 40. Probably more than that. All right, 41. We won this match. The game. We won the game, not the match. Now we're tied up. We're all tied up here at Michael Bay Stadium. Bumblecloud won the match. Wow. We've been watching the second season of Luke Cage. And, like, they, there's, like, so many thick Jamaican accents in that season. And it's really, it's really satisfying. I'm really, like, a fan of hearing them. It comes to we... All right, I'm gonna put Mike B's number in the chat so you guys can don't me don't do it, <laughs> so you guys can text him. Oh God, are we just gonna lose to Glistener Elf? Well, you put the first six numbers, and the rest are random. Huh? So, so there's so there's nine thousand nine hundred ninety-nine combinations. Are we texting Mike B on it? <laughs> Oh man. I don't think Chris has my number. I bet he does. Hey man, you got that bird soldier man. Bird soldier. <clears throat> Oh man, what is this? Have I seen Meet Joe Black? I don't think I've seen Meet Joe Black. Why are we clicking that at our, at our own risk? I was gonna say I didn't think Chris is my number. I mean, he could, he could mess me on Facebook, but that's not the same as texting. It's different, you know. Michael B. This guy, look at this, look at this. I like playing this instead and then just going to get, then we can play this guy and, and amplify it next turn. Sunny D, it'll burn your throat. Sunny D. Tell me more about your Sunny D. There's not much more to say. Your Sunny D's position. 
Hey, man. Let me hear about your sunny disposition, man. See, now I got this stupid Jamaican accent stuck in my head, and it's not even you stupid. You do it the cheesy it's way, man. You just keep saying mon after every other word. That's true. That is, that is the cop-out method. Three machines plus one, plus one, and trample until end of turn. Sure. Um, is it another creature? On target, we're going to return this. Target itself, I guess. So, I guess you can cycle this, but now we're still trading. Sure. So, I, got, I gave them a card, but I get to trade here. Totally fine. <clears throat> totally fine. Oh, I got an Avison's Pilgrim. Oh, I'm a little pilgrim, man. I'm your little pilgrim, man. Uh... Shut up, Michael. I didn't say anything. Yeah. Let's keep it that way. Okay? <laughs> Never. Look at your trash wolf. <laughs> You're being rude right now. Oh, well, maybe if he wasn't made of trash. Then what? It wouldn't have to be. You wouldn't have to be rude if he wasn't made of trash? Yeah. Why do you have to be rude? Because he is made of trash. That doesn't make any sense. That's just how life is, man. That it isn't. That's just hurtful. You're just being hurtful. I got some Sunny D in the fridge, but every time I look at it, I hear Mike B's siren song in my head and pick another beverage. <laughs> Any desire to play a probably bad, I have no confidence in my modern brewing skills, vampire man estate. Yeah, Josh, 100%. I thought I, I thought I would eat a deck anyway. Mike B, did you get a haircut? I did. I did. <laughs> he did. Sunny D, it'll burn your throat. Thanks. I think it looks pretty okay. Go on. It's kind of expensive, so, you know. What's expensive? I got the fancy part, you know? Did you get the fancy part in the movie? Yeah. That's so cool, dude. Do you really want Sunny D right now? Don't you know it'll burn your throat? Don't you know about Sunny D's burning, th burning your throat capabilities? I'd be honestly, how much did you pay for your haircut? Uh, with tip, it came out to like 27 bucks. You don't get that $200 haircut? No. <laughs> you think I can afford that? Woo! I don't know what you can afford. I'm not your dad. I mean, I could probably go someplace and it would cost me $200 for the same haircut. I haven't seen five a lot. I don't know what that means. I was going to spend haircut, but that homeless man was totally worth the price. Look at this flashy boy. Flashy boys. Same question for Frank. Wait, are you not his... I can never tell if these are serious questions or not. What's your haircut cost? I've been going to the same person for my haircut for like 15 years. Are you okay? I'll be fine. And uh, she only charges me like 20 bucks. It's not bad. No, it's fine. And then I tip her. Another 20 yeah, another 20 on top. <laughs> Man. You should get black eyes. It's going to be like the, the darker guy, Fieri. You pay $75 for your haircut. He does live in New York, though. That seems ridiculous. I'm sorry. But I'm sure there's probably places in New York where you can get your haircut for less than $75. No, nowhere. 75 or bust all day. Oh, hair washing and a head massage. Head massage is like... Woo! Yeah, I've been to one of those places once. It was like an extra 10 bucks, but it was totally worth. Oh, man. We get to make them discard their last card? Stop it. So here's my number. Call me Mike B. And it was a land. Cutting your own hair is definitely profitable. I cut my own hair, but it's pretty uneven. That's true, but it doesn't affect your attractiveness, so. If you can get away with it, it's like, knock yourself out. Save yourself the 20 to $70. 
This guy's just getting in there for two. He's like, you know what? It is time. It is time. Naya Hushblade. Michael, be quiet. Eat these time. Eat these time. Uh, is that what I'm doing here? No. Eat these time, my girl. Nope. Don't like that. I'm going to actually angelic purge this and get rid of this. And now we have seven cards in our graveyard, so we're almost at Threshy Hold. <laughs> Is there a haircut vacuum thing? Yeah, it's called the suck cut. And it was on uh it was on Wayne's World. Well, it definitely sucks. You definitely suck. Your mother sucks. Hey, look at this. We're crushing this dude, we are killing this first this first draft. <sighs> I'm calling the police. Bober says what? Bober says what? Is that what you said? <laughs> oh, Lord. What are you, you going to call the police? What are you going to tell them? That, that I hope they're having a wonderful day and, and see you later. It always looks like you're looking down. I, that's my secret, Michael. I am always looking down. <laughs> oh, yes. Snap'ems, McKeep'ems. Of the McKeep'ems Enterprise. So here's my Michael. Call him later. You gotta get him to go in a circle. <laughs> Harder than it looks. That's what she said. Jeez, looks on Smiter was this 2012? Yeah. Is Luxon Smiter that old? 2012? Dude, this is like Ravnica, Return to Ravnica. That's not 2012, though, right? Boo, it's old. Uh, 2000, it's literally 2012. Oh, dang. Literally seven years ago, Man, dude. Man, that makes me feel old. Well, you are old, so. I think that's about how long we've known each other. No way. Ha, oh, no way. We just met yesterday. No way, we just met yesterday. Is that a fog bank? Yeah, buddy. What is this? 1998 9? 1998 9? 1998. We can still judge unworthy it, which is nice. Judge unworthy. I am your judge unworthy. Judge unworthy. And it's got flying? God. Tired of it. I ain't having it, man. I'm tired of it. What are you doing? Well, how can I get you to stop? I see. You can't. You'll never get me to stop. Oh, boy. 
it's really rough. Never gonna get it. Never gonna stop. Never gonna get it. Never stop. Get it. Get it. Get it. Never stop. Pop. 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 Do you say Deo? I do say Deo. Oh, 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 oh. Do we just gamble and just put these all on the bottom? Because I don't want any of them. Oh, I did it with Rot Wolf. Nice. Did it with the Rot Wolf. Got a like trash can wolf. White, white trash can wolf? I said more like. Interesting. Oh, 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 the Shriek Geist. I feel like I've just wanted the, um, the naturalize in every match. Naturalize. Look what they're naturalized. You know what? That is rude. Oh. Oh. Well, then. Oh, that's just little biscuits. Are you going to block? No? Okay. Do we have anything that gets things back? I don't think so. But we do want to keep threshold, so. Oh, oh, oh. Michael B. Man, Shriek Guy seems scary when there's a when there's delve and threshold in the format. You're just like, oh no, that's a lot of things. The mic stuff. Are you just clearing the board here? No blocks? I said, damn. Overload the board. I said, damn, damn, damn. Did you? Yeah. Yeah, I don't think so. Man. Just this guy, huh? Okay. Just this guy. Hey, just just attacking with this guy, man. Oh, God, he did the mon again. God, it's such a low-hanging fruit for the Jamaican accent. Oh, oh, oh. Apparently when the cup has nothing in it, it's real easy to just blow right over. Looks like a pile of hair. What well, looks like a pile of hair? That guy on the board. This is like a pile of hair. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, some bumble clots, a bumble clots every now and then. Dude, I don't know what it is, but like just listening to the accents, I'm like, this is satisfying. These are really good accents. People making them Pokemon references. Lord of mercy. I wish any of these <coughs> were beasts, but alas, here we are. Colin Howe is not Hootie Mandrill's a beast. How are you not a beast? 
Who's that Pokemon? Your mama. Hmm. That's your Pokemama. Yeah, I figured they were going to block like this. Who's that Michael B? So we lose Kavu and Brackwater. And we lose probably Rotwolf, because they don't want to risk getting the damage on. My father was a pizza eater and a fiend. What does this do? Oh god, they're just going to mill us. So one night he goes crazy. He goes off crazier than usual. <laughs> Mommy gets the napkins to defend herself. He doesn't like that. Not one bit. So me, watching, he takes the hungry Howies to her, laughing while he does it. He turns to me and he says, Are you hungry? He comes at me with the flavored crust. Mmm, Cajun. He sticks the crust in my mouth. Signature crust. <laughs> wow. That was amazing. <laughs> Oh, Lord. <laughs> Chris messaged me, you win this round. I'll get that number. Nope, not a fan of that. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Well, we only have 13 cards left, so that's good. I think we're dead. I think they're milling us out. This is why I'm here, and I'm so mad about it. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. What do we got? We got a human soldier. This is an elephant soldier wall. We got two soldiers. I like that. Oh, boyum. Here comes the goyim. Tell me more about the goyim. I'll only tell you more about the goyim if you tell me more about the 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 the, 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 the Are you are you are you having a stroke? <laughs> I couldn't think of anything that dig it, dig that it, worked. Dig it, dig it. Kettle corn, kettle corn, kettle kettle. No, that's not it. Kettle corn, kettle kettle corn, kettle cook kettle cook jalapeno chips. What do you got? A counter spell? You got a spell pierce? We got a dispel. Really? What do you got? Flustered? Sure. I missed the sub. Oh, it's just elk tears. Let's put some, let's put some crust on that face. <laughs> oh God, no! God, no! You can see it for that. Yeah, we had thirteen cards left. They're just gonna mill us for like two, four, six, like ten next turn. Not with that kind of attitude. They aren't gonna. Why would my attitude affect that? Because it does, man. Okay. I don't control the rules. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. How many creatures actually get buffed with this Muraganda Petrogalafis? Literally zero, I think. Even if they did, you don't want to put. You have to put more black mana in. For Muraganda Petroglyphs? Oh, <laughs> I thought you were talking about that card. What card? The Just card below it. Wood Wraith Strangler? Yeah. Why? He looks like a beefy boy. He could probably. He's a two-two. He's he looks beefy. Man, you look beefy. He's a two-two for five mana. That's not good. No, man. Don't do it. It's not worth it. Is it not? <sighs> machi. What's that going to do, man? I'm just trying to add more cards so that I can't get milled as easily, okay? Oh yeah, adding adding three more cards that'll really that'll do them in, boy. It will do them in. You don't know how Millen works. Yes, I will play first. I'll keep this. I don't think they can do anything about. Like they can't beat us. We're unbeatable. Really? Wow. I know. I know. Shocking. You're shocking. Am I? No, I don't know, man. I just work here. Just leave me alone. Can you leave me alone? No. I'm gonna call my manager. 
You see if I care. Call your manager. Okay. Go beep 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 beep. What is that? That's your manager. That's is his... it a robot? No, that's his. That's his number when you dial it in. Beep boop beep 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 boop beep. So if you're really good with uh, telephones, you can figure that number out and you can call him and tell him to fire Frank. What if I am really good at telephones? You'll know the number. I will. Yeah. What if I already know it? What if the What if the call's coming from inside the building? The call's coming from inside the building. <gasps> what if your mom is coming from inside the building? Don't know what that means. Yeah, you think about it. Are we calling Frank's manager and saying they should fire him on it? Oh, Lord. Oh, I wonder who his manager is. Frank's streaming service. Hey, buddy. Uh, you should fire that Frank guy. Okay, I'll take this under advisement. Uh, do you have any formal complaints you'd like to file? Wow, he hung up on me. That's unbelievable. Wow. That's just rude. <laughs> it's like an incoming call from Chris. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, my God. This chat has gone off the rails. I don't know whether to play this flyer here or this really, really great value, this good value hooting mandrels. I always play the hooter, man. But they got this guy. So what? You can still trample him. But can I bample him? And that's that's the important part. No. That's illegal. Bampling is illegal? Everybody knows that, man. <sighs> America. Am I right? <laughs> What's that guy do? What do you do? It's the flippy guy, right? No, Michael. It's the flippy guy, ain't it? Ain't it? Hey, the goddamn flipping eye! Jesus. Oh. When he dies, you cascade. <laughs> yeah, I feel like chaps. Like I feel like chaps implies there's no ass, right? I think that's always the case, right? I think so. I had a piece of chicken in my tooth. Well, a piece of chicken in my tooth. Just shut up. Just chicken, shut up. Chicken in my tooth. I'm a chicken tooth. Yeah. Chicken in my tooth. I'm a chicken tooth. Yeah. Chicken, 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 but I'm telling you, I didn't burn down the school. It was the gosh darn flippy guy. Hmm. Chicken man gonna burn your tooth. Just pay the two minutes in the pool. I had some chicken soup last night. Chicken tooth? Chicken soup. Chicken tooth sounds like a gangster name. It was homemade chicken soup. It was pretty good. Where was it? Whose home was it made in? My buddy Todd's. Why wow, you trusted Todd's chicken soup? Yeah, it was delicious. I wouldn't trust that dude. I wouldn't trust. I that even dude bought f plastic spoons and paper bowls for it. Plastic spoons and paper bowls is the name yeah, of my first spent, indie album. I basically spent seven dollars to try his soup. <laughs> what a maniac! But I did win the poker game, so it still all, it all worked out. Did it? Yeah. Did it all work out? I was really far behind when we were heads up, but I just won two of the flips for all in, and there you go. There you go, man. Sunday chicken Sunday. Sunday chicken Sunday. Oh, I go. Yeah, this is fine. See what you flip. He revealed Godzilla. Oh, a Nimbus Nyad. Sure.
sure play your little Nimbus Nyad. Mike, do you wear a cowboy hat when you play poker? No, but I should start. Why? Then I can be Doyle Brunson. Do you think that would make you another human being? Yes. Wow. That's... I would also have to age like 50 years. But you can do that, right? Yeah. On a whim. That guy's 86. I was 86 once. What happened? Went back in time. Idiot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know you went back in time. You know, that apparently it hasn't been invented, but has it been? Who knows? I don't think you're... I don't think you're using your brain, your brain pad. Oh, he turned 87. Duh. That makes sense, yeah. He was 86, now he's 87. Gotcha. Same. Uh, I don't know what this is. What's the answer to this? I think it's you. Uh, hold on. Author gives you, author gives you. I'm just trying to do a thing. I think those my oh right we did it nailed it okay so beginning combat let's go to the combat what how old are you seven you must be like Benjamin Button Benjamin Button is a weird movie right like it's a very weird movie it's just a movie that like it wasn't that great, but it really affected the culture because now people have this Benjamin Button reference where they're like, you clearly age backwards like Benjamin Button. Like, everyone knows that reference, but, like, the movie... Because it was, like, the first movie to do that. But who cares about that? I don't know. Apparently, the, the whole world. The whole world? Mm-hmm. Wow. The world. I'm trying to do my FMLA paperwork last night. The website just wouldn't let me enter my email address, even though it's a valid email address. FMLA? Yeah. What was that? I don't know what it actually stands for, but it's like paperwork, so you can... Uh, basically, it's like saying you can take a day off, and it won't like count against you and stuff. Wait, what, for work? Yeah. Why? Family Medical Leave Act. Oh, that's what it stands for, apparently. Why? Is it because you're... Is it because laziness is a diagnosed medical condition now? Yes, actually, yeah. It is. That's, that's messed up, man. I'm really sorry that you have to go through that. I'm just getting it as a backup just in case, so if I need to take it off, I actually can and not, not get in trouble for it. I feel like you should have done that before you got your 26 absences, right? Probably, yeah. Huh. That probably would have been a smarter move. Fascinating. That would have been called a pro-gamer move. <laughs> <laughs> this is a real pro-gamer move. <clears throat> so since it won't work online, I'm gonna have to actually call someone and talk to them. Oh god, it's gonna I'm be so the worst. Sorry. Look at this little oh, my Storm Rider spirit. I wonder if FMLA covers milk of the puppies. <laughs> <laughs> Good <coughs> lord. Oh, I see. Well, isn't that Sunday truck on Sunday? All right, go. You can have your shriek guys back. I don't want to put counter on this guy. Oh, Michael Beasles. He lives in the treasles. He might have measles. His name is Michael Beasles. Holy shit, 26, question mark. You provide some serious value for them to put up with that. What does that mean? It means you have 26 absences. Oh, 26. That's what you have to be like... I thought you meant like age. I'm like, wait, I'm not 26. <laughs> I'm not 26. I just said I was seven years old. Tap this guy. I guess we're just passing here. This is unexciting. Was it 26 or was it higher? No, I think 26 was the actual number. When they when they were like finally like, hey buddy, you gotta stop doing that. I don't actually know how you have a job. It's mind blowing to me. They're really tolerant. They really don't want people to leave. Yeah, people but you really take advantage of it too. Uh, well, you gotta grease the goblin, as they say. No one says that. I just did. 
No one, no one says. It's a well-known saying: "Grease the goblin." Okay. <laughs> if you don't grease the goblin, how is he going to get his grease? Maybe in your, maybe in your world, maybe in your sick world, you disgusting, s- you disgusting pig. You make me sick. Kirk is flying. What? <laughs> Reese the Goblin, Pepe Frog. I like that. That's pretty good. That's a nice use of that. Seriously, Frank B's boss, or I mean Mike B's boss, is a huge Frank Lepore fan. Maybe that's it. Maybe they watch your stream and they're like, I can't fire that guy. He needs to have his. He needs to be able to stream sometimes. Yeah, that's what. That's what they're thinking. Yeah, probably. I mean, I don't know why else. Oh, Jupiter and Mars. In other words, his name's Michael B. Four, five, six, seven. So, I think we sacrifice just a land as always. One, two, three, four. You know the time frame of the 26? Is it like in the last 20 years or like last month? No, it was like in a over a period of a, about a year and a couple months. Okay, hold on. Let's do this correctly. Choose target creature, artifact, or enchantment. This one. One, two, three. Let's like this. In other words... Oh, Michael B., take me to the sea. Let me touch the bees. Oh. Isn't that just your last name? No, I was talking about physical bees. Physical bees? Yeah. What's a physical bee? <laughs> the opposite of a anti-physical bee. Anti-physical bee. <laughs> the word we're looking for is figurative. Figurative bee. <laughs> I think Mike B is a superhero. His power, no man can fire him. Well, that ain't true. I can vouch for that. Yeah, I did get fired from the other job. That's true. That did happen. And the other one. No, that was the only job I've ever been fired from. Well, technically that and the uh, Chetty technically fired me, so. Uh, no, you were in, no, you had a job and then you got fired from that job. Yeah. And then you went to the next job and then during training, you missed too many days and they fired you from training. No, I didn't get fired. I quit that job. I just didn't show up. I stopped going. I didn't actually get fired. That's not what you told us. Didn't I? No, you missed training, and they were like, they, they, you said they let you go. I'm trying to think. That's, all, the, all the firings run together. It's too many things. This is too many floaty boys. But we do have this. <laughs> she boat. fired for getting caught drinking out of the garbage can. I mean, they like that. I clean it up. <laughs> that's, just, that's disgusting. Maybe you should just be a janitor. He sucks out of garbage cans, not drinking. That would be disgusting. (laughs) Yeah, that's where he sucks all the juice out. Oh, God, don't do that. Uh, I want you to stop it. (laughs) Naturalize would still be nice. Or a neck snap. What is this? What is this? Deals two damage to attacking creature without flying. To each attacking creature? Well, that's pretty interesting. Did Cutie Boy get fired from the... You mean Sweetie Boy? Was it Sweetie Boy? I think it was Sweetie Boy. I think it was Sweetie Boy. Unless Michael's Jamaican accent. Hey, man. Michael B is a little Sweetie Boy. What job, what job did you quit? your mom honestly mike you should work at a grocery store you get all the trash juice and sunny d a seven-year-old needs to be healthy wow (laughs) oh that's what i was looking for that's what that's what we wanted i do a little neck snap I snap my neck back and forth. Oh, Josh, I've done stuff like that. I know what you're talking about. 
Just inventorying. Did that when I worked for PetSmart. Which was not a great company to work for. Because you couldn't get all the dog food you wanted after after you after you started working there, you found out? Yeah. Actually I think dog food is disgusting. I think you're I disgusting. I hate the smell of it. I hate the smell of you. It's messed up, man. Got it. God, this is so obnoxious. Apostle's Blessing is just like, well, I'm done. Anyway, 2-1. Not too bad for the first Chaos Draft. Um, yeah, we're just going to get milled out eventually. They just have their, their defenses are too good. Their deck was good. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on Twitch, Patreon, Manatraders.com, Twitter if you want. Uh, Twitter. Coolstuffinc.com. I had a new article go up, I believe, today. I can find out right now. I'm going to check it out. I did. It is Polymorphin and Modern. It is about the Jake P deck. Definitely check that out. Leave a comment on the article itself, guys. Really appreciate that. I will be back. Uh, I'll see you next time. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Thanks for watching.